checking out 13 properties my boy Dom just locked up in one package. Uh, we're, we're going with one of uh, my investors, Jaime, one of my good friends, buys a lot of properties, checking them all out. This one's right by the lake. And what's the ARV on this? Uh, as is, it's uh, 210. But uh, yeah, you see they're doing a renovation, so they changed it. it was a, initially it was a 2 1, and now they changed it to a uh, 3 2. So the ARV jumps up about, to about 300. Dang, okay. And it's like in a prime location. So we're about to go check out all 12 of them. Um, my boy Jaime wants to buy the whole package. He buys package deals, so we're gonna see if we can get him a deal. And uh, yeah, that's what we do, 13 and one. Actually, my boy got 15 properties on one day with this package, so. And he just, and one of them just got sold today. And we're about to sell 13, so that's how we do it. Yes, sir. All right, so what'd you think about that one? That was good. That was good, right? It was nice. It was just a little odd. Uh, it just set back really weird, but I mean, it's clean. Um, yeah, like the floors were nice, the structure looked good. Um, had central air, had three, three bedrooms, three two bedrooms, bathrooms. Bathroom. The neighbor is nice. Utility room, study room. You could, could you could it felt solid. It looked, yeah. you know, the sea rock could be preserved, you know. You think you can make that study room into a room or no? It's too small. That's way too small. You need to pull up desk in there. It's way too small. It's odd, right? You just leave it alone. They should have just made one room bigger. You just leave it alone. Just leave it the way it is. Mm -hmm. So they, so you say out of all the packages you get, there's usually one ugly duckling. There's always one. <laughs> there's always one that's like... <laughs> and that one wasn't that bad for being the ugly duckling. No, for it being the bottom bad. one? That wasn't that bad. No, nah, for it being the bottom Sorry, one, it's not bad at all. Yeah, Look, needs a roof, needs a roof. Um, what do you what do you think it will cost to, to clean the house up? Oh, that one? I mean, what would you try to do with it? Like, just clean it up. Just owner finance it or something? Yeah, clean it up, owner finance it. Just the way it is, really. I wouldn't do, like, without doing a rehab, clean it up. That's what I'm saying, you what wouldn't you rehab think? it though, right? Well, you'd put a roof, you'd have to put a roof. I don't know, shit, maybe like 15 or something? What do you think? Less? No, I think maybe 20, 25, 20? yeah. But then it'd be nice, nice. Like you talking about you clean the shit out of that. It's like a mild rehab. Well, you'd have to figure out something to do with the outside, maybe. I don't know. I mean, you gotta look at the days on market. You know, what if it, what if you could just clean it up just the way it is and just, you know, paint the car, not really carpet, because I think those floors you can get away with, so. Yeah. Maybe 20, 15, 20. Yeah. It's hard though, because sometimes when they have their stuff inside of it, and they're living in it, it looks livable, it looks good, but once they take all this shit out, then it's like, uh, yeah, yeah. it's like, oh man, I didn't see this, I didn't see that, and right. you know, look, they start noticing things, and then that's when you start spending money, that's why you have a little bit of contingency, so yeah, yeah. 15 best case, but yeah, yeah, probably yeah. closer to 20. Yeah, you're right. 20, 20 is still like a make ready. But still like make a, ready, ready. Well, you, you don't want to open, you start opening up walls, you start doing things you don't need to, then you're gonna spend a whole lot of money and that's not the type of neighborhood, or that's not the type of house you're gonna wanna right. open a can of worms in. Right, right, right. Oh yeah, this is it right here. It's that one right there, yeah. Yeah. This is also another one of them, but even this one's really nice. So is this house number four? Yes. This is the cleanest one so far. Sounds empty. It smells like smoke. Is that like a duplex or what? Oh, no. oh dang. That's not. Is that part of the house? Yeah. Oh, the back little garage thing? Yeah, it has a little barbecue pit on wheels. It's the nicest one so far. From the outside, at least. Look, this concrete's pretty new. Yeah. But from the outside, it looks like the inside would look nice, but you never know. It can't be too, too bad. Designed to it. Yep. A nice curb. Let's see if we put a new roof. Parking. New drive. New driveway. The roof looks in good shape, too. Oh, look, you got new concrete on this, too. Yeah, so I said new driveway, yeah. Does this one have a lock box? Oh, somebody lives here. Yeah, I'm gonna get Man, it doesn't even look like a car's been on here for one time. Right? Man, it's a big ass backyard. Yeah, so I had one here before. Yeah, and it was the same shit. The house went from this side of the street to the other side of the street. 
Oh shit. Could you build a house on the other side? No, right there all one one. Oh yeah, this was split in half right here. Oh really? Yeah. This neighbor's lot is split in half. There's a house in Italy, there's a some on the other side. Is this lot too? Yeah, like no, that's the fence right there. And there's a house on the other side. Like you see the roof line? So you can split it. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're right. Right over there. Yeah, yeah this is a what is it? Yeah, I ain't picked it up. I'll let it move that shit out though. Somebody's sleeping. It looks pretty clean though. It looks nice in there. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They got floors and shit. Look like you remodeled this one. Those, those are like great floors. Looks like it's in good bones though. Yeah. In good shape. You said new roof? Yeah, new roof and new slab. New concrete. So what do you like about this side of town? Well, I got some over here. And, um... I think they're doing all the development they're doing right here on um, Lone Star and just La Vaca and all the South Town, all the food places. I mean, if you Uber Eat around here, man, you're gonna get some really good food. Um, I think South Town is moving this direction. So, and you don't get the architecture right here close to the, to downtown. It's perfect, it's perfect. So close to everything. So this, this little, so there's three houses on this little property, or not, I mean in this little area. So we got this property, this property, and the one behind it. And as you can tell, uh, there was a fight or something. They <laughs> got liquor bottles broken. They obviously broke the glass with that. Glass all over the floor. And you, that's what you do with an investment real estate. So be prepared. It's the island boy. Nice house, man. And you know what, when they develop the street, this, this guy's gonna do by some eateries. It's not that potential. Potential for Don Rodrigo Hill. You wanna try to get in? I haven't done all of them so far, Don. This is fun. This is what I like to do for a living. I'll never work. That's what I do for a living. When was the last time you went out looking at properties like this? Oh, heads up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, shit. <laughs> you got a chain on there. Eh? Uh, it looked whoa. like he was charging. Um, the last time I went to go look at properties like this, I, I actually go often. I mean, 13 of them? I've never done that. <laughs> um, I never got a package deal before. But no, I, I look at properties every day. Like I buy some of them that we get. I like to look at them. I, I love the process of everything that we do. I like, I like, uh, like I still am in like, so my acquisition agents, sometimes I'm in a good mood at work and I'm feeling good and I just tell them to pass me all the hot leads and I try to close them myself still. Like just to get, like it's just fun to me. I like to do it. Um, and then when we get deals sometimes, I still have buyers that I used to talk to when I first started. So I just like call up my people. Yeah, hey, I got a deal for you. I still go out there, try to sell it. It's fun to me, you know? So I like I like the whole process of wholesaling. It's dope. Like I got it exactly where I wanted. Like this is what I dreamed of. Like when I first started, like I loved wholesaling. It was fun. Like I like it. But now I got it to the point where I could choose if I want to do it or not. Like if I'm just in a good mood, fuck it. Let me try to close a deal. Let me try to sell a deal. Um, or I go buy a deal now. You know, it's fun. The whole process is fun to me. I just love real estate in general. Everything about it. Uh, the negotiations. The um, the closing. You know, closing sellers, closing buyers. Um, everything about it, making content, I love everything about it. It's like, I don't know, life's a dream right now, you know? So, <clears throat> we are definitely living the dream, so yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna go uh, make the next vlog on this house that we're buying the Dom got for 95 and it's worth 235 and it's in over there by Ingram, good yeah. side of town. And I'm gonna go buy it, so we're gonna do the next vlog and that. Like, you walk in, graffiti everywhere. Uh, the son was like a, a drug addict and he let all his friends come in so the mom just wanted to get rid of it. Um, 
it's crazy like that i've never seen a house like that like you walk in it's like graffiti all over every wall like a party house it's crazy so you're gonna what are you gonna do with it i think i'm gonna flip it or i'm gonna hotel it so basically what i'm gonna do is it's full of junk so i'm gonna just go with a dumpster and it's on a nice side of town just dump everything out and then um we're either it's gonna paint all the walls one color and put it on the market nice little hotel little hotel yeah got a bunch of shit everywhere a bunch of stuff everywhere yeah um real old house you know two one two one yeah real it's real small um small kitchen needs a lot of, needs some work this is this is the, this is the worst one yeah this one needs a lot of work what did that lady say she didn't live there she said she didn't live there so i guess she just oh she don't live there kids, yeah um yeah it's a two bedroom um yeah i need jerry yeah, need for I need a full need a full rehab on that one. Oh, she said she she, left, she actually lived it. Yeah, so that's what she said. I don't know. She, she maybe the grandma, maybe the mother and dad, the grandma or something. Cause there's some kids in there sleeping. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that one's a green. Yeah. So like on a house like that, like it's a, it's a small house. What would you what would you put as the rehab on that house? To keep it or to flip it or what? Well, I mean you're gonna. I mean, you're gonna sign an ARV to it, so you know the ARV you think you're gonna get for it. I mean, you're gonna have to fix it to that. So, what do you think? You know, I didn't really look at it inside his back. What do you think? What do you think? Yeah. What do you think? It's like, like, what would you put it at? Really like Forty to fifty? Yeah. yeah, I don't know. Man, look at that! Look at that barbecue thing. It's so good. The smoker, <laughs> the pipes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's bad out. Okay. Alright, now we're in your territory, Dom. Final house? Yeah, that's one. Oh, Alright, so we just got done going to every single property. It was a total of 12 all over the city. Uh, walked into all of them. We had a few crazy stories on a few of them. Uh, one of them got what? It was like a, a raid or yeah, something? Yeah, for a casino. And they were running an illegal casino. They were running an illegal casino. The city had choppers. I heard him say that army tank. <laughs> I swear he said that. But uh, yeah, man, we just came out to eat. Uh, took my boy Jaime out to eat. He's really interested. I think he's going to get it. So yeah, we wrapped it up pretty much A to Z in one day. So that's how we do it at Clutch Investment Group. I want to give a shout out to my, my boy Dom for making that happen. He spent a lot of hours on that. And uh, man, that's how you get it done. Stay clutch. Yeah.